Hello guys, welcome back to another video, and today we're gonna I'm gonna be going over my predictions for the college football ga bowl games in 2022-2023. So our first bowl game is Friday, December 16th. That's next week, at least for now. Um, it's the Bahamas Bowl, Miami, Ohio versus UAB. Um, you know I, I'm taking. I'm taking UAB on this one. They had a good win against BYU last year. So that's always good to see. So I th I'm thinking UAB will win this one. The Cure Bowl, number 24, Troy versus number 25, UTSA. Well, UTSA almost, almost had a good win against... Um, Against Houston, it was a good loss, and then Troy had a good win to App State. So when they were ranked, so I'm taking Troy on this one. Cincinnati, Louisville, in the Fenway Bowl at Fenway Park, which is a baseball game. Um, I'm taking Louisville on this one. Yeah, Louisville. This is this is gonna be an upset. Louisville. Celebration Bowl, Jackson State versus NC Central. I mean, without Coach Prime anymore, you don't have Coach Prime. You don't have these players that transferred over to Colorado. And I thought it, I've heard that he was bringing some coaching staff over. So I'm taking NC Central. Las Vegas Bowl, Oregon versus Florida, Oregon, Oregon State versus Florida at in the Las Vegas Bowl. I'm gonna take Oregon State on this one. Florida hasn't been very good this season, and Oregon State made a massive comeback against Oregon, who is uh, I think they were a top ten team at the time, so that was a big win for them. The LA Bowl, Washington State versus Fresno State. Um, you know, I'm actually gonna take I'm gonna take Washington State on this one. Well, I'm gonna take Washington State on this one because they're Washington State and yeah. The Landing Tree Bowl, Rice versus Southern Mississippi. I don't really have a say on this one because I haven't really watched or paid attention to either of these teams, but let's go Rice, why not? New Mexico Bowl, SMU versus BYU. Just give me a second. SMU, baby. SMU, I'm going to wear this still a little bit. SMU is going to come on top of BYU. I know that for a fact. Boise State versus Texas, North Texas in the Frisco Bowl. Um, let's take the main green in this one. Boise State lost, lost a few big games, especially like BYU. They're kind of trash. And, um, in North Texas, they have the home field advantage. They might have more fans. Well, it's not really home t field advantage. It's like home state advantage. I don't even know if you count it as a home state advantage because it's like Texas, and they might have to travel like travel like five hours, six hours maybe. So, still taking North Texas. Uh, Marshall versus UConn in the Myrtle Beach Bowl. Um, well, Marshall, um, what was I think? I'm thinking of Maryland right now. But UConn, um, the only game I watched with them was against Utah State in the beginning of the year, week zero. So, and they kept it close with Utah State, I'm pretty sure. I mean, it wasn't like blowout, but it wasn't like close game, last second field goal. So I'm going to take Marshall. Uh, the famous Idaho Potato Bowl, 
Eastern Michigan versus San Jose State. Um, San Jose State has been pretty good. So San Jose State. Boca Raton Bowl, Liberty versus Toledo. Um, well, Toledo coming out of the MAC championship, Liberty beating big name teams like BYU. I'm gonna take Toledo in the Boca Raton. The New Orleans Bowl, South Alabama versus Western Kentucky. I'm gonna take South Alabama in this one. Take it. I'm first is Bowl, Baylor versus Air Force. I'm taking Baylor. The Gasparilla Bowl, Lake Forest versus Mi Missouri. Honestly, I didn't even know how to say it. I just took a guess. But I'm going to take Lake Forest. They've been pretty dominant in the ACC. Couldn't make the championship though. The Independence Bowl, Houston versus Louisiana. Well, I know, um, oh, sorry, that Louisiana has been has been pretty good this year, so it's not like they kind of suck. And Houston, they're like I think they're middle of the AAC, so I'm gonna take Louisiana. In this one. Middle Tennessee State versus San Diego State. I'm gonna pick the upset here in the Hawaii Bowl, Little Tennessee State. December 16th. Uh, Quick Lane Bowl. Uh, Bowling Green versus New Mexico State. I'm gonna take Bowling Green on this one. Out of Kentucky. First Responders Bowl, Memphis versus Utah State. Like I said, Utah State hasn't been very good. I don't know if I mentioned this, but uh, Utah State hasn't been very good in the past, so I'm going to put it like this. Uh, the Birmingham Bowl, Coastal Carolina and East Carolina. Uh, Coastal Carolina lost their quarterback. He could be returned, he could return it in the bowl game, but I, but I don't think he'll still be at 100%, so I'm taking East Carolina. Buffalo versus Georgia Southern. I mean, Georgia Southern and Buffalo. I'm going to take Buffalo on this one. Oklahoma State, Wisconsin in the guaranteed rate bowl. Um, let's take Oklahoma State on this one. Mm -hmm. They had a good win against Oklahoma and I kind of steamrolled. They, I think they did really get killed by TCU, but... They kept it close. Um, in the military bowl, Duke versus UCF. Um, I'm gonna pick Duke on this one. I'm gonna pick Duke. In the Liberty Bowl, we have Arkansas versus Kansas. Um, well, Arkansas out of the SEC has had some good wins, and Kansas out of the Big Twelve. I don't know on this one. I'm going to take Arkansas. Or actually, Kansas. 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 For the underdog. Uh, number 15, Oregon versus North Carolina. Oregon. In the Texas Bowl, Texas Tech. Yeah. Texas Tech versus Ole Miss. Um, Ole Miss has been dominant in the SEC. Let's go with them. Ole Miss. Um, the pin pinstripe goal, Minnesota versus Syracuse. Um, let, let's go Syracuse with this one. They won't have to travel far because it's in, because it's in the Bronx in New York. So I don't think they'll have to travel that far, and their fans won't have to travel that far, and they'll want to support their team. So, Syracuse. In the Cheez It Bowl, number 13, Florida State versus Oklahoma. Well, Oklahoma hasn't been very good this season. They they lost Caleb Williams. They lost Lincoln, Lincoln Riley. They lost players to the transfer, po transfer portal. So I'm going with Florida State on this one. Uh, number 12, Washington versus number 20, Texas. I think Washington. Uh, I think Texas could. 
pull up the episode. If I did hooker or not. Ah, oh, that's so scary. If um oh it's fucking I'm not typing anything. So, um, B. John Robinson, that's what I was thinking of. B. John Robinson. In the sun, er, okay, in the Orange Bowl, if B. John Robinson plays good, it'll be Texas, and if they don't, it'll be Washington. In the Orange Bowl, number six, Tennessee versus number seven, Clemson. I'm going to take Tennessee in this one. Because, because... Because Tennessee has been dominant all year. They beat Alabama. So it's like, it, they're just good. So, Tennessee. The Dukes Mayo Bowl, number 23, NC State versus Maryland. I'm going to take Maryland in this game. Kept it close with Ohio State. Num- in the Sun Bowl, number 18, UCLA versus Pitt. I'm actually going to take Pitt in the upset here. In the Gator Bowl, South Carol- number 19, South Carolina versus number 21, Notre Dame. Uh, I'm going to go South Carolina because they've been dominant, beat a good Clemson team going to the Orange Bowl. So, here it is. In the Arizona Bowl, Ohio versus Wyoming. Both of those aren't real states. But, Wyoming. Wyoming. The Fiesta Bowl, college football playoff semifinal. Michigan, number 2, Michigan versus number 3, TCU. I'm going to take number three TCU on this one, the upset. In the Peach Bowl, number one, Georgia versus number four, Ohio State. I'm going to take number one, Georgia. They've just been dominant all year. The Music City Bowl, Iowa versus Kentucky. I'm going to take Kentucky in Nashville to get up, to, but to, win the, to win the Music City. The Sugar Bowl, out number five, Alabama versus number nine, Kansas State. I'm going to take Alabama in this one to win it. Um, in the Reliquest Bowl, uh, number 22, Mississippi State versus Illinois. Illinois. Uh, I'm going to take Mississippi State. In the Citrus Bowl, number 17, LSU versus Purdue. Um, I'm going to take I'm going to take LSU on this one. Um, and then in the, in the Cotton Bowl. Number 10, USC versus number 16, Tulane. I wish I had a Tulane hat so bad. But I'm picking number 16, Tulane. In the Rose Bowl, just let me put a hat on real quick. Number 8, Utah versus number 11, Penn State. I'm going to take Utah. In the college football playoff national championship game. So I picked Georgia and TCU. I'm going to pick Georgia to win that game. Georgia will be the back-to-back national champions. Thank y'all for watching and I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace out.